and welcome to my channel and we're back and we're doing more Dragon Race and it is Thursday the 5th of August so yeah I was only here a couple of days ago and I'm I'm back already yay so <laughs> I told you it was Dragon August so this is the one I'm going to start on today I'm not sure how long I've got to paint today but we're going to start with this one now this is if you're not familiar with what I'm doing uh what all this is about uh I, this is the picture I'm doing sorry I this is the picture I'm doing and uh, there is a playlist for all the kitting up and the earlier parts of this but basically I'm vlogging the entire painting which is two meters wide nearly but anyway <laughs> we'll start with this and so this is this square and as you can see this is very very confetti heavy I think I've counted up all the colors that are in it and I think it's 13 different colors in this one square so I've got them all set out on the side but I've got my cases uh, close by in case I've missed one but yeah this one's gonna be a slow one and so yeah let's get straight into this so I'm just gonna start the I'll start the clock because I am timing it just for curiosity's sake not for you know any meaningful race type thing then no, that would be ironic dragon race race yeah so let's start with the nice oh actually before I start let's talk about this so <laughs> actually let's talk about two things let's talk about my thumb so I was editing the vlog from the other day and uh, it's got this really annoying catch I'm so sorry I broke my thumb now and it's one of those ones that ripped across and you know where you're trying to save yourself the deep pain of it ripping across the nail bed so it's all this funny little cut off bit and you're you're praying that this little bit doesn't catch and it does look really ugly and i i forget sometimes how close this camera zooms in and yeah it wasn't very nice sorry about that the other thing talking of close-ups so i was looking and up here somewhere it was which is a piece i'd done like a couple a month ago or whatever and I noticed there was this drill, it really showed up because uh, when I was editing that um, there was something wrong with the drill and I was like, well, how did I miss? Because it looked like a tab, I could see a shadow and it was like, it wasn't a tab, I don't know if you can see because obviously I had to pull it out, I don't know if it's going to focus but basically I've got this drill and it hasn't tabs, the holes, it had two holes in it so that it's like it was like an inverse tab so I could see the shadow and uh, yeah, it was just... Uh, grooves I'll, I'll, I'll see if I can take a picture of it and insert it if I remember but um yeah so I fished that out I, I to be honest it would never have been seen it was the only reason I could see it is because we were so zoomed in which is a good lesson there because uh, obviously when you're looking at your diamond painting close up this is not how everybody in, else in the world will look at it when it's finished which is why I shouldn't worry about the grooves the, the gaps uh, we're doing 807 and things that there was another one that was like I thought that I placed the other day and it looked like it had a little tab up there and I fished that one out as well microscopic <laughs> it was just like okay that isn't yeah microscopic uh tab no way we're gonna see that so yeah I I, I did pull it out because I'd already pulled it out to look at it but let's start one two three one two three four but I think if I hadn't seen it, it would have made absolutely no difference. Absolutely no difference. So we're going to start on the confetti. And we're going to start. Uh, one, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. And the fourth one. Um, I've learned. We, we start with the confetti and we'll finish off with the part with the symbol that there's the most of because it's easier to fill that in afterwards um, but yeah I think this one's gonna be slow this particular section because of all the color changes talking of talking of my broken thumbnail uh, that, that's the where I've realized that's probably why I was struggling the other day so, do you remember there was one that was really full up and I can't get open uh, the reason for that I've realized now because I have literally no thumbnail so I had a very sore thumb afterwards because I was using my 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 thumb my, th my skin my skin right uh, next color let's do let's do all the ones that's got next to nothing of 
So this one only has one of. So I'll just put this in. I've got glue on my... I didn't clean my tweezers since last time. The tweezers, because they're touching the canvas, they do like pick up little bits of glue sometimes just on the end, on the tips. Which is good sometimes because it helps you pick them up. But sometimes it helps you. You're trying to pick up one and you end up picking up two. Right, so that's that one done. Nice and easy. One, six, nine. So how are we all? How is everybody doing? You're surprised, aren't you, that I'm back so quickly? Because <laughs> I, I, I am the world's worst offender. Is like, oh, yeah, I'll be back. I'll be back soon. All right, tumbleweed. Two weeks later, I roll up. And uh, one, two, three. So get that. Okay, there's no two done. Uh, yeah, so I uh, I was like, oh, I really, really want to do more. Because I'm eager at the moment. I am eager. Uh, what should we do next? Let's do this little hurdle thing. 317. Oh, this is the one that's like super rammed full. That was the one I had the trouble with the other day. It's so full. It doesn't, it barely even rattles. They are rammed in. It's just an accident waiting to happen. At least I remember that I, in fact, I'm not even going to put my tweezers down for this. This needs care. Care. We did it. Right, I need four. Uh, let's, I will put it in the tray. Because I don't even trust myself to hold that pot. That's how full it is. Right, so we're on these. I thought I'd do this square because, um, it does look interesting. This is the part of the tree that we were talking about, the tree top. So it's the first time we've been doing interesting confetti. Most of the time it's just been blue so far. Right, so one up and two across, one up, two across. So I thought, yeah, let's do it, let's do it. And I've got you. I've got you. I'll, I'll zoom in a, a little bit more in a minute. But I like. I think I, the way I like to do it is I like to start it off now, where you can see like a portion of the of the painting uh, around the see a portion of the painting area that's around it for some context, and then we'll zoom in, and you can see all my. It, that's another thing. Honestly, cameras are so unflattering. It may, I, I, I was zoomed in. My knuckles, it's look, I look like a, a Neanderthal. <laughs> I just like, I swear my hands look normal like everybody else, but no. Oh, apart from, so yeah, sorry. I do have, that's another thing I should probably apologise for. Um, let's do this one. 3810. Um, I do, unfortunately, get eczema on my hands, just on my knuckles sometimes. And it's not bad. I don't have medication for it. I just put cream on every now and again. Um, one, two, and then three. But, one, two, three. Again, because we're so zoomed in, uh, it makes it look worse. Or maybe it's just me realising that it doesn't look so bad, but it can look quite um, <laughs> a bit dry, a bit skanky. Right, two across, and of course it's um, it's worse. This last year or more is even worse. One, two, three, and then the fourth, because one, two, three, oop. one, two, three, four. Yes, because you know, no matter how much cream you put on. Like you're putting the hat, you're washing your hat. We, everybody, the world is washing their hands like every five minutes and putting uh, antibacterial on as well every five minutes. It's just like, oh. And you you try and moisturise it as much as you can, but it, it takes its wear and tear. Right, let's put those away. Right, 517. I only need one of that. Let's do this. Where's it go? I've lost my spot now. Right, so under there. I can't even remember where I was going with that conversation before I started wibbling about 
my crusty hands. <laughs> oh yes, I was talking about how I'm going to zoom it in. So I'll start out so you can see like some context of the area around it. But then I am going to zoom in so you can see a bit more. And then at the end we'll zoom out again. It's just like, surprise, this is how much I've not done. Right. Uh, let's do this one. Oh, there's a few of those. 3815. I must be careful. I keep, because I've got my phone with Pattern Keeper on to the side here, I keep turning my head to see what's coming up next. So sorry if the sound, I've, I've mentioned this before. I, I do try to remember um, not to talk when I've got my head turned away because you know, it changes the sound. But what can I say? I've got the memory of a goldfish. So I keep forgetting. <laughs> Bottom line, I just keep forgetting. Right, one there and one there. It's green. We're on the greens. I might live to regret that. I, I get excited about green. I, I might be sick of green soon. But that's why I'm trying to mix it up. Because I do have more blue to do, like over here and going down. But I thought, let's do some green. Life on the edge. And, uh, yeah, that's the plan. All right, and one more up there. That goes in there. Tick. And done. You know, I was saying as well, I had that um, app to tr to track how much I was doing each time. Ah, I forgot one. Did I? Oh no, I forgot to tick it off. Right, tick that off. Tick. Okay. One, six, one. Uh, yeah, I've got that app that tells you like you could put your goal in of when you want it finished and it tells you how many drills you have to do a day which I'm not even going to admit to let's just say there hasn't been a video oh there was, there's been one video that I've done on this vlog where I've done more than what is required each day to finish and that is per day <laughs> not even oh, I never did get the glue off them, them tweezers let me, get, let me do that now glue ow Stab myself. Well done. Right. Where was we? One sixty-one. I still had one to go. Uh, yeah, it wasn't the year two thousand and thirty-two. It was the year two thousand and sixty-two. <laughs> two thousand and sixty-two. If I carried on painting at the speed that I was, so <laughs> hopefully that is another reason why I'm back so quick. I think I looked at that. I was just like, oh my god. I, I will probably be dead in 2062, unless I'm very lucky. Uh, right. 3816. Let's do this. We need seven of those. Oop. That is more than seven. Shocker. Oh, well, there's a shell drill. That's trash. Oh, I didn't get my trash pots out. Hang on. Oh, I'm just gonna put it there for a second. I'll do it. I'll do it when I've put these away. Right. Uh, yeah. Can you imagine? I mean, I know I want to take my time with it, despite the two years that I, I've said I want to take to do it. Um, I won't, you know, be crying into my Cheerios too much if it takes longer. But I think 2062 is pushing it. <laughs> Oh my god. Right. Oh, by the way, this is a good time to say so. Assuming you're still here, you'll be interested, probably, um, if you're sticking it out this far. But uh, there's a problem with. Oh, hang on, let me tip this off. Tick. Right. There is a problem with YouTube at the moment and comments. And people's comments are disappearing. Like, my comments are disappearing on other people's videos. 
and I've been spotting people's comments on my videos disappearing as well um, I did check their support forums and it does seem like there's a problem with I think it's connected to their spam bot right just put that trash away um, yeah so there's something is clearly up with YouTube spam bot and it's just deleting people's comments left, right and centre. So if I uh, do not think I'm ignoring you. Right, 9.31. Um, do not think I'm ignoring you. Or either, because you might have posted, and this counts for both of my channels, uh, you might have posted on one of my videos and it's disappeared. And if so, I've not, I might not have even seen it. And Or I might be trying to reply to your comment because it is happening on people's own own videos like it, you know on my channel I could reply to, can't be impossible to reply to one of my own videos on my own channel so just be aware of that and um, if anybody ever wants to contact it I'll try that again if anybody ever wants to contact me remember that my um, email address is down in the comments I'm on the Instagram Instagram and Facebook for that matter. That links to that is down in my com in my description as well. And also, I I don't know if I've got it set up yet. I'm in the process of doing it because I, you know I got a bit cranky when um, I found out my comments were being deleted. I can't, uh, just technology sometimes annoys me, and uh, I hate having all my eggs in one basket. So I've actually, or I'm in the process of. Let me tick off these things setting up a Facebook group for both my colouring and my diamond painting channels. So if you want to check the description, then if the Facebook is live, the group is live, and oh, oh that's my first ping of the day. Um, if you want to come and join me on Facebook, it's just going to be a place to chill out. I, I, you know... It's more about just knowing that I can contact you with, you know, I've got a place to talk to you that isn't at the mercy of YouTube. And, yeah, yeah, basically. Uh, if it's not live, then go to my Facebook page. And if you like or follow my Facebook page, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to be sending out, you can do this thing that people who follow your page, uh, you can send out an invite to join the group so if you do that then right two, two in this gap if you do that then when it goes live then um, yeah I can just send the invite uh, but yeah don't please don't think I mean I'm I can be slow to answer comments but I do always answer them so if if I don't it means either you're you've been deleted or I've been deleted one of the two, 931, let's put these away. And hopefully they will fix this problem soon. Like I say, it was on their support forum, but um, the post was like more than two weeks old where they said, right, we're looking into it. So we'll keep you updated. 597. 597, who's still on 597? There it is. Yeah, that's, so that's my little rant. <laughs> oh, I, I do get on my little, little uh, wibbles. Right, one, two, one. two. Three. On the other side. Oh, so this isn't, isn't too bad. Because we've only got two colours left now for this section, so the rest should fill in quite quickly. Oops, drop the drill. Get back. Three seven six six. This one. Three 
So now it's starting to get quick. And uh, yeah, it can start to whiz through, in theory. Oh, that's got a tab on it. Let's get that. It's my trash. Do you know what? I'm going to be fussy. Get rid of that one as well. I should put my trash pot a bit closer, shouldn't I? Right. One there. One there. One there. Sorry, you can tell. <laughs> I'm thinking. I've gone all quiet. Uh, sorry about that. I um, if I'm I'm focusing on something, then I do go a bit. I can't multitask very well. Right. So I think that's all my sixes. Do them. Tick them off. We'll find out in a minute. So now I've only got these ones left. We can whiz through these. This is. What is this? Eight one three. Let's just yeah. Let's just whiz through those. All right, and last four. And I didn't make any mistakes. It all added up. I just, I don't even. <laughs> uh, you know what I'm like. I nearly always mess up something. But no. Oh, get off. Today. Today apparently is a good day for, um, for working on Pattern Keeper. Right. Let's put this away. Eight, one, three. Put it away before I spill it. And that's a square done. I made pretty good time as well. Right, so, um, what am I gonna do now? Let's, I'll just get my straightener out. But yeah, a reminder, like, we are looking at this really close under the, mag sort of the magnifying glass for all intents and purposes. Honestly, you don't need to really worry about it like I am. I just, I don't want there to be a line, because I'm doing them 10 by 10s, I just want to make sure that it's not, it doesn't look like there's a distinct line where I'm changing blocks. So that's why I just poke a bit. Right, so the question is now, do I carry on across and do, I, I think maybe I will. Because then that would give us that whole block, wouldn't it? Shall we do that? That means I've just got to cut the paper. Well, let's do that now. Because I actually remember to bring out my scissors. It's almost like I'm learning. Um, right, well, let's see what we've got. Take that off, first of all. See what we've got in our next section. Right, so the next section... This is the 813 that we were just working on, and I did put it away, but I'm going to leave that to last because that is most of the section again. And But we don't have much. It doesn't look very interesting, but I've uncovered it now, so I'm committed. So we only need one, two, three, four, four or five colours, and I don't, I've not used that today, so I'll need to dig that. 959. Let me find 959. Fortunately, my handy storage system made that nice and quick. So we just need that, and then let's. We'll do this the same way as we did the last one. We'll do all the small confetti first, of which there isn't a huge amount to be honest. But we, we'll start with nine five nine, because that's only got three, and then I'll finish off again with this blue, which was the eight one three, and I'll probably time lapse through that as well, because. I don't know why I put so many in. I only need three. Didn't I only say I needed three? I mean, it's not a huge amount, but it's definitely more than three. What am I like? Okay. 
So, yeah. Um, completely forgot what I'm saying. I distract myself. Isn't that terrible? I do actually manage to distract myself. I don't even need any help. Right, so, f two, four, so that goes there. Yes. And then two up from there. One, two, and then that one. Done. Five, nine, seven. Oh, no, that's here. Besides, as I say, this is... I'm going to be doing the whole painting on video. It is just not practical to show every single second uh, in real time. But I'm going to do most of it in real time. I don't know how I'm going to find something interesting to say. Um, for that many hours. One, two. The answer is I won't. I'll just wibble. Um, right. This goes here. Oh. Got a, got a squeaky, squeaky easel. I'll have to look at the... It's just screws. It's like a hinge. So I've been thinking about getting a new easel. This one is just a little one that I've been using for... Well, I bought it originally for me to do my adult colouring on when I'm... On the rare occasion I feel like um, colouring and watching TV. It doesn't happen very often. But once in a while, the urge will take me if I really want to do something. Two things at the same time. Right, what was that? Five nine seven. Where'd it go? Where's my pot? Five nine seven. There we go. Um, so it's only like sort of A four. It's like A four high or letter. A four high and no, it's a bit bigger than that. But it's um, not very, not much. And it's got this little. It's got a little bit of table to one side of it and a little bit of table to the right hand side of it. Um, but at the moment, of course, my canvas is much bigger. This is a, what is this, a 70 by 50, so it's, it's it overhangs everywhere. So I was thinking about getting one of those A2, is it A2? Yeah, I wasn't going to go for A3. I was just like, let's go, just go for something. You know, just one of the desktop ones, because I do this at my dining room table. Uh, 3766, which, not going to lie, is a bit of a pain. Because any time I want to do it, obviously it takes a while to set up. So I have to clear the table and get the tripod. I have my nice little tablecloth, which looks like wood. It's fake. My, not that you see much of it at the moment. You can see a little bit of it up there. But um, my lovely wooden background is not, it's not wooden. <laughs> it's not. Right. Let's go into this. It is just one of those sort of... Um, PVC style tablecloths because then I figured and I literally only use it for filming that way in the hopes that I will keep it remotely clean I've got some paint on it I don't mind getting the paint on it that makes it look like it makes me feel arty <laughs> but um, yeah and then you'll say the camera and the tripod and the, because I'm working on the easel I always use my light my box light now, even though it's summer. Oop. But yeah, it does take a while to set up. But I'm determined this will all be on camera. Just so that the day that I finish it, because I will fin- Oop. I will finish it. I'll come back. Right. Then it's going to be a miracle. And then when the miracle is done, I've got to figure out how to stick it all together. <laughs> and obviously I want to seal it. I've never actually sealed a painting before. But I'll be sealing this because uh, it's going up on the wall. So I've got to figure out how to stick them all together. I mean, I do have a plan, but having a plan and putting it into practice isn't always the same thing, is it? One there. One there. And one there. Put the 
this away. 3766. Take those off. And now we have only got 813 left for all the rest of this. Uh, now, where did I put my 813? There it is. Yeah, right, so I can whiz through this. This should be quick. I will still be counting. Oh, there's, there's a trash drill. Get rid of that. I should probably look more before I start, as opposed to just finding them on the, on the fly. Right, let me do 813 again then. Right, well, it might not be the most exciting block that I've done, but it is, it was at least fast. But faster for you, because unfortunately, when I switched to time lapse, I forgot to press the button. And I know why, it's because um, the camera's on one of those goosenecks, so if I knock it or touch it, it like, it, there's like a little earthquake <laughs> that goes off for like 30 seconds. So I always wait for it to stop wobbling whenever I touch the camera, and I, I stopped to uh and i i yeah i i forgot to I wait for the end of the wobble and i just started uh, i hadn't done much i've done a few rows at the top so that is that one all of 813 done i just realized though as well uh, I, like you're barely in the camera so i'll have to move the camera in a second because i think i will carry on it's going well and it's going quickly oh get out So yeah, let me just, I'm going to put, just put this paper back in, where's my scissors? <clears throat> I'll just snip that so it can go up there. And uh, yeah, that is all in here. I'll get that in there, really close. Because that's the other thing, when I noticed the camera was really zoomed in before. You can actually see little bits of fluff. Now, I don't keep this out in the open. I don't hang this. I hang this up, but I've got one of those big portfolio bags. So it sits inside there. There shouldn't be a lot of dust. So it must just pick up dust. I don't know when I'm pulling out, other because I have other paintings. My wolf is in there. And uh, it must just pick up a bit of dust every time it opens up. Or just when it's sitting here. Anyway, right. <laughs> God, shh, stop. Right, so that is two pieces done. That wasn't as exciting as I hoped. Let's see what's in the next section. Tip those off. Yeah, so if I carry on going over, it's pretty much the same. So I think what I'll do, if we're gonna do blue, then we may as well, then I think I might start going down to here, which is one of these and uh, then that starts and then I can move across and then that starts getting us into the tree so I doubt if we get that far today yeah I'm going to do this one next maybe these two let's see how it goes uh, but I will have to we will move the camera for you because that is going to be and then I'll try and get you a little bit more central in fact that, oh, I'm going to zoom you in right yeah let's do that okay how does that look We'll go for that. So I think we've just got like three different symbols in here. So let's go. So 958, 807 I've got out. So 996 and 958. I don't think I've got either of those out. No. Right. So those, those two are out. I should have, when I moved the camera, I should have made some space. Shouldn't I? Let's go with this first anyway. So nine five eight and let's do this. Oh. Just gonna make some space here. Right, let's start with this. Um, yes, no, I think I have used this colour. We just that's this this is that green. I like this green. Well get that in. 
one, two, three, nice and simple diagonal. What are we going to do? We're going to tick it off. <laughs> That's what I've been doing today. I've been really good at ticking things off and uh, it helps. One, two, three, four, and then one, two, three, four, and then that goes there. And then we go one, two, one, two, yep. And then we've got one in here. Tick, 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 tick. Don't forget to tick. Yeah, this is shaping up to be a good... You know, that's the kiss of death, isn't it? I was about to say, it's a good day. And uh, I'm not making... I've not screwed anything up. <laughs> so I, sh I should know better not to say that. One, two, three. Because then I'll just massively mess something up. And... Uh, It'll take me an hour <laughs> to figure out what I've done wrong. And we've got two up from there. Two. So I just noticed the canvas is moving. That's the bulldog clip, so I'll fix that in a second. Um, so, wait. Hang on. One, two, three. So, one, two, three gap. And then there. And then there. those off they come down so that was nine five eight we'll put that away and let me fix this bulldog clip I might just take it off I've got other bulldog clips on to uh, stop the canvas moving around but I've just got one to the side here taking it off was not the answer just putting it on properly apparently was who'd have thought right let's do let's do this other color 996 so we've got a lot of these we've got we've got a lot of 996 and we've got a lot of 9807 I'll do the 996 first Nice bright blue though. Look at that. Okay, so this is the eight oh seven that I'm just finishing off now. But yeah, it's going well. I think this shows just how important it is to oh that's I've not dropped many drills today to be fair um how important it is to um not leave long gaps between doing it because I'm I think I'm better at this just because I only last worked on the painting two days ago and you know I'm better with tweezers because I've used them recently I'm better with my I don't know coordination I suppose of being able to look at the drills I'm placing and at pattern keeper at the same time and I'm not constantly having to do that counting like, oh, I'll keep pause here and sometimes even count it on pattern keeper like four across and whatever down and uh, now it's just like because my coordination is getting a little bit more practiced um, yeah. Right, let's put 807 away. And I think I'm going to do this next block. Even though I know that's nearly all 807 as well. But um, it's the one because there's so much of it. That's why I want to do the smaller colours. That's, a, yeah, definitely the smaller colours is the way to go. So let's see. Because I do have a bit of confetti again coming in the corner more of the tree 
So let's see what we've got here. And there's some of the colours I haven't used today. I'm going to have to move out some of these pots. All right. Let's see. Um, we've got one nine four. What is this? No, five one seven. I tell you, all these, all these numbers. I'm not dyslexic, but it kind of. <laughs> Like you're just seeing numbers, so many numbers, and it's like five one seven and five seven one, and I just oh. it just I get a little bit addled sometimes. I I have to double check myself, so I only need one of these. So I'm gonna put that there. I'm gonna put that out of the way. I'm gonna tick it off. And what else do I only have a couple? So have I got this moon thing? Three eight one four. Three eight one four. And I just need one of those. A lovely turquoise green nut. Don't know if you can see that. And it goes right next door. Yeah, I'm still not 100% sure about the lighting. I might go back to the inside on. We'll see. Right. Next symbol. 3765. Do I have that one out? Yes, I do. So we need three of those. I am going to be lazy and pull them out the pot. I should be careful though, because that's probably how... That's more likely how I'm going to get a trash drill. Oh, how I'm going to get a trash drill up there uh, without realising. No. Honestly, the fiddling around, I probably should just put it in a tray. It's just as easy. Right. Um. Just make a three, six, nine, ten. Yeah. I was just making sure I had a grid of ten because the line isn't very dark there for some reason. Right, tick those off. Right, I did need to get three eight four eight out, so that's a new colour for today. Yeah, just tick it out. <laughs> I need three. I did it again. Look at this. I'm so rubbish. I just, I can't help myself. I cannot help myself. Right. So we'll put that there. And we'll put that there. But I am quicker at picking them up. And I think it's, it will help me if I find in little tabs or lips that I might otherwise miss. So I really should just put everything in the tray. well maybe not one maybe two three or more three or more I need to put in a tray over there what's this funny little wiggly thing what are we doing with funny little thing wiggly things three seven six oh do I have that out no another new color for the day right how many do I need three we'll put them in the tray just a few Oh. I'm getting better. <laughs> right, 3760. Which is another blue. Uh, two up. To get a bit gloomy out there. I thought this is another reason why I want to work on this painting a little bit as well. Because whilst the weather is it's quite warm, well, it's our seasonal. It's more seasonal how it's supposed to be in the UK, so I think it's about 21 or 22, something like that, um, at the moment. So it's actually quite comfortable to have the windows and things shut while I film. And I don't get so sweaty, because nobody likes sweaty. Right. Tick. Three of those. 3810. I've got those out. I oh, know I've done those. Oh, there it is. Just a few. 
You can do it. There. <laughs> I'm learning. For like a few seconds, I remembered. Right. One there, one there, and then one down there. Two nine five eights. I'm going to pick those out of the pot. I can do it. That's all. I need one of those over here. And then I need one of those. Where does that go? One, two, three. One, two, three, four down. Three across. Now, now again, just like before, we've only got 996 and 807 left. So I am going to do that next. Right, so I did the 807 first and then went to the 996 because the 996 is the one I've got the AB for again so I've just I want to do the same as up there where it's just like I don't want any symmetry so I've, I'm filling in the regular ones first I'm trying not to build a pattern too much of a pattern but I don't want it also too close to the edge I want it more it's got to be at least an inch or two in, so I'm doing all of these ones. Take those off. Um, yep, do those. And then I think I'm going to fill in these two with normal. has to go. Actually, I think that one can go. And then I think that one. And the rest I'm going to put in as AB. So tick those off. That one keeps sticking up. I should have my imagination. Oh, where did it come from? There. Yeah, let's put these 996 away and we'll get the ABs out. No, that was 966. Told you I was. <laughs> oh, I did just die at these numbers. The mess of my head. Right, 996. And we will put in a few ABs. And where is my where is my wax pen? Right. Just make sure. Yep. And one thing about the wax pen is you can't press very hard, so if there's any tight fits. to go in afterwards just to force it in and I think there I'll just get that one nudged in there we go um, I never push very hard on any of these drills even the regular ones with the tweezers there we go um, I always like roll it down afterwards and the reason for that is because I'm so prone to doing it in the wrong places I don't want to press too hard in case I have to go back and um, I fix something. So the harder I press at the beginning, the harder it is to get it off. Right, so that is my AVs done. 
put those away. Just a little sparkle. Oh, did I drop one? I did. Can't lose an AB, it's my precious. All right, close that lid. Yeah. I don't know why I use my fingers. I could just use this straightener, which is the sole reason why I have a straightener here. To nudge things together. Right. So that is another hundred drills done. Tip those off. Uh, tick, 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 tick. Uh, let's do one more then. Just one more. Maybe one more. Yeah, one more. Right. So we will go for 959. 959. So we just need two of those. Tick. What's this? 517. You know, <laughs> this is insane. This is where you really do feel the confetti more than anything. Ooh, oh. <laughs> yes, yes, you know I did. Right, so I need five of these. So obviously, I had to do that many. Um, I've got so many pots of drills out. One, two, three, four. For all these little sections um, two four two four that goes there yes um, yeah it's just insane amount of pots for such a small section of painting one two three four that's in the fifth one that one's easy because that goes next to it. But I, I, I love confetti painting, so I don't mind. Despite me uh, commenting on it, wibbling on it. Um, yeah, I really do not mind. I enjoy this. This is my kind of fun. I'm a plodder. So I ooh, nearly dropped. Nearly. But not quite. Um, 161, we need two of those. Uh, yeah, I am. Um, I l absolutely enjoy. Like sometimes I want to rush. One, two, one. No. But not on a project like this. This is like my fine wine. <laughs> I just, I take my time and I savour it. Right, put that on there. And the next one we'll do, what well, we've got a few of. Two of those, see the colours okay it looks kind of dark on my screen my eyeballs they see it fine but the, the screen but I'm just looking at my phone so it's hard to tell right we go for what we've got these 9.30 yep well I've got a few of those so I can put that in the tray Um, uh oh. Uh oh. 
I've done something wrong here, haven't I? Right. That's right. Alright, that's two. Oops, run out of memory. <laughs> run out of memory and gone wrong. It's just like, oh, it's all happening, all of the things. Right, so I have gone wrong. And because that, we basically need to all move up one. So, what was I saying about not sticking things down too hard? This is why. Because you miscount it. And then, of course, you base everything else. So, yes, two, three. And then you base everything else off of what you've already placed as opposed to counting across. So the earlier you make the mistake, the more everything else goes wrong. So one, two, three, four. One, two, three. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Okay. Right. So this is 9.30. Um, it was going so well I was obviously getting a bit cocky <laughs> just, yeah I'm doing everything fine I've nailed this now it's okay it was only a little mistake and that is the advantage of doing the confetti a bit early because it's more likely your mistakes will show up when you're doing the confetti one, two, so that means that, and that, go there, and just to check, that's the space, yes. Okay, we're back in business, we're back in business, it was, it was a small mistake, we're okay. Right, so three more left, we're going to be doing bottom corner. Space on there, space on there, yep, 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 and then that goes there. Okay, tick, put these away. Let's do this little moon three eight one four. Three eight one four, I've got that out, yes. So we need four of those. Yeah, nailing it. Nailing it. Like a boss. Right. One, two, three, four up. One, two, three across. Yes. See, that's what happens. I make a mistake and now I'm paranoid about everything else. So one, that goes in there. Tighten, tidy that up a little bit. So I don't really need to worry because when all the drills are in it will tidy itself up anyway and where's the next one that one goes there yes and then after that I think we will call it a day because I'm not sure what we're up to at the moment because obviously some of you your footage is in time-lapse but I think in in real time, my time, um, we're going on. Well, by the time we finish, eight twenty-four. Okay, that's a new colour. Just need one. Um, by the time I'm done with this, I think it'll be approaching two hours. Because I'll have done where does this go? In here. Because I'll have done five hundred drills by the time this is done. Five boxes. Which is pretty good. Right. Um Let's do what we've got the least of. We haven't got many of them. 931. Three of those. So. Um, 
and um, when I am when I do stop I will obviously zoom out again so that you can see I mean it's still not <laughs> still not much of a picture still early days but you know we we'll get there right tick 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 931 where did I put the pot there it is and it's fun to be able to use ABs a bit though I must admit I can't wait until to get <laughs> I know I'm like I want to get to the other parts of the painting just so I can use more right um next we will do what have we got the least of We've got some 807s, there's not a huge amount of those, so we'll do that. If I can find them again, 807. <laughs> must admit I don't think I'll be sorry to see the back of 807 though this is the oh have I done that one I've done those ones I've not ticked it off um because there's been a, that's what most of this area is uh, I've done yeah I think I've done all of that But I know there's plenty more because it's telling me I've still got another 1,000 drills of 807 to place. And let's do. Oh, what's up this one? I didn't notice this one. There's only three of those. 3750. Is that out? Yes, it is. Oh, I certainly did three. We will put them in the pot tray. No, in this though, look, I'll forget by next session. It's fine. Everything will be back to normal. Okay, so that goes there. Yeah, we got some darker colours working in. Oops, don't. And there. So I don't really think we'll be able to see what it is straight away. The tree, the tree top. But at least we're seeing something now. So three more colours to go. Let's do 3808, which is right here. I love this. This is that deep sort of foresty foresty green just with a hint of turquoisey oh, words I can't describe things very well right so we got this one and this one it's a lovely yeah lovely deep green It's so deep that now that I'm laying it on the canvas, it's not black, but it, it you know, in certain lights, if it was in low light, um, it would look almost black. But it's not, and you'll see that when I when I get this, um, like the bigger, the zoomed out one, it should be better lighting and. Um, Hopefully you can see the differences in colours. And one more. Tick. Tick. 
3810. Where's that? Right there. Right, I've got quite a lot of these and the next one, which is the last two. Right, this is the last of the 3848 and then we are done for the day. Uh, yeah, if you're still here, <laughs> say no, don't say hello. Let's say, oh, look, I've got your little stuck to my finger. How did I manage that? Don't even know. Let's say, let's confuse everybody who um, reads the comments in the future. Let's say, oh, get off some random word, but a random word that we've used in the, in the on the day. No, let's just say the colour. Let's say blue. Blue, 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 blue. No, you, you only have to say one blue. That's me saying a lot of blues. Right, let me get you zoomed out. Actually, let me tick off this in Pattern Keeper first. Oh, I've just zoomed out and I can see. Yeah, okay. Let me, let me get you zoomed out on the camera and you can see what I just saw on Pattern Keeper. Right, there it is. We have tree, so that's the tree that we was doing before, but here we've got more tree. And the reason why I uh, went, ooh, is this is what it looks like on Pattern Keeper. Because obviously with Pattern Keeper you can zoom it out more as well. And uh, yeah, I can see th there's the tree. <laughs> Actually, there should be a secret word. Let's say the secret word is tree. Tree. Okay. And uh, yeah, so that is what we've done. A few more ABs. Oh, let's stop the let's stop the clock. That's the next thing to do. Oh, I I, I did spend a bit of time changing the camera, so it's like two hours five, perhaps. A bit over two hours, two hours eight or something. Um, yeah, so two hours, and that was five hundred stitch today, and we are point six seven of percent. <laughs> getting there wow but that's good so that means we've done 800 801 drills this week let me show you this other one hang on so that other app that i'm talking about is called stitch pal so you can put in your pattern and you know fill out the details of it so you've i, I added it on the 14th of the 6th because that's when i found the app but obviously I started it on so you can zoom well you, you do little um, installments so the first time I painted on it was the 13th of May so you can just put it in and if you want you can attach a picture and so that is the one that I did on Tuesday so if we do that add and I'm not gonna take a photo right now but we'll just say when we use stitching, we'll change the time to what time do we start? About eleven ish again. Let's say eleven thirty. This doesn't matter. It's it's just a, a thing. And number of stitches, and we did. What did I say we did? Five hundred. And not. Oh. Right. How long did you stitch? And we'll say two hours, we'll say two hours and five, just because I did wibble a bit. Comment, well put in tree, tree, um, that needs an exclamation mark, right, okay. This really um, disor not disorientates me, but like this phone vibrates every time you type on the keyboard. <laughs> Um, okay, so and then you add, and so yeah, pr and then we go to the progress update. Yeah, 500 stitches. So, on the average, from when I started on the 13th of May, wasn't it? I've done two, 33 stitches a day, and you've got this little calculator up here. Let me go to that. So, that tells you how many stitches are remaining, um, where I've put in my target date, 
if you remove this target date, it will say at this rate, oh, look, I've shaved seven years off <laughs> today's session. At this rate, you'll finish your pattern on the 16th of December, 2055. So yeah, um, and you know, I'll put that date back after. So yeah, I just thought I'd share that with you. It's called Stitch Pal, it's free. Uh, but you can just put in, as you can see, you can put in your um, picture at the end of the progress. I've got to do one for the 10th of June and then the 13th of May, which is the first one. I don't know why I forgot the 10th of June one. But uh, that's easy enough. I can just screenshot that from my videos. But yeah, you can just take it as you go along. It says 1% done. It's not. Uh, just as soon as I went over 0.5, it, it rounds it up. Anyway, I just thought I'd share that. We're done for the day. We're done for the week, actually, because it's Thursday. I won't get to this on Friday. So hopefully I will be back next week with more. And uh, hopefully I can get shave a few more years <laughs> off my pattern. Thank you for watching. See you all again soon.